Nigel, a disappointing result, but in some ways the game turned on fine margins. Yeah, there were there were very fine margins today, and um, from our point of view, you know, there was uh, too many first up missed tackles, and particularly the one just before half time from a, from a line up. You know, those are situations you've just got to be able to defend against. Um, and bear in mind, you know, that came from. Uh, a lineup that we had, um, we would give a penalty away. So that was hugely frustrating, really, from my point of view. Um, and then the other thing is our lineup. Our lineup did not function at all well today and didn't give us a platform to play off. And uh, that was a big factor today. So you know, the um, the number of first up missed miss tackles and uh, the ineffectiveness of our lineup and the ability to play from our lineup probably the two key factors. You know, I can't look much beyond that really in terms of the performance. I thought there were elements of the performance that were were good. Um, um, but you know, again, I, I would say probably that uh, they brought a physicality at times, particularly with their big ball carriers, which, uh, which, which put us under pressure. Gloucester got back into the game. You could see uh, just before half time, scored again to bring themselves back in touch and took the field in the second half with, uh, with, with, with real endeavour, really, but then couldn't take advantage of being a, a man up with a yellow card for Wasps. Yeah, that was a key moment, really. Um, I felt at that stage we'd, we'd taken the kick off and we'd got into, we'd exited well, got into a good field position. It was almost perfect in terms of what we'd have looked to do. And then we had a five metre line out and uh, with a, them a man shot. Um, and again, we, we allowed them to, to come in. We didn't manage the line up as, as we should have, which meant that uh, you know that momentum was taken away. So that was that was our chance really to get back into the game, and um, you know, on the back of a, a very soft try that we gave away at the end of the first half. It, small margins, we say, in the game defensively caused some problems, but um, equally the scrimmage seemed to struggle in the later stages too. Yeah, I thought you know um, when. When we had a, a starting pack on, I thought we were fine. It was uh, it was a good contest, and the sides were evenly matched. But we did seem to come under pressure when we made some of the changes, and um, uh, you know that that was disappointing. Uh, I was uh, I haven't seen the video back, but uh, the forward pass that uh, that that obviously made them have that scrum. I wasn't sure it was that forward. You know, we should good intent again to play, um, but it wasn't rewarded. As you say, good intent. Uh, it looked like Johnny was away around the outside on that occasion, and then a uh, cynical yellow card, Charlie, uh, d managed to get in behind the defence, and he looked to be in on the running as well towards the end of the game. Yeah, yeah, that's very frustrating. They, you know, they were, you could say they were smart there, but um, you know, we created those opportunities. Charlie did well, I think he did exactly the right thing to you know, the kick ahead, and it was a great kick. He most probably would have won the race, but he was taken out, so they are fine margins. Um, I felt they're on the contact area as well. Um, we weren't able to get the speed of ball always that we wanted. That was partly due to us, um, but partly also because I don't think always their tacklers were releasing. Um, but you know, they are fine margins. You've got to be able to deal with that. As I said, fundamentally, um, there was there was a lot of effort, a lot of endeavour there. But the two key areas we lacked uh, a game from our lineup, and we um, we missed twenty first attacks. A fourth try there would have been important to gain a bonus point. Points are going to be important now for the final running. Do you think that puts you out of the running for seventh place? Well, you never say never. I think, you know, points wise, we're, we can still do it. But Wasps are, are playing well at the moment. You know, I thought uh, they played some good rugby themselves today. Some good individual players in there. So it's going to be tough, but, you know, we'll, we'll give it a go. We've got a reasonable running. Um, and so all we can do is go out there and, and, and try and get get as much as we can from the next two games.